Hey guys, it's AG Chloe here, and I'm here with Mia, and today we are doing a review on the Our Generation Pink Bathtub Set. I just got this set today, and uh, my grandmother gave it to me because um, she was making my dolls a bathtub, but she saw this in Target and it was on sale, so she thought she'd get this for me instead of finishing the bathtub. So I'm really thankful that she got it for me. And I, like, thanked her a billion times, and I offered paying the money back, but she said not to, so. Anyways, Mia's in it right now, and I'm just gathering the accessories, which I probably should have done before I started the video. Okay, so anyways, yeah. Sorry to do, like, an opening video. I was just too excited. Okay, so I'm going to take Mia out of it for now. As you can see, it just, she fits nicely in it. Um... Her feet are right up against there, so it's just the perfect size, and there's a little bit of foot room. Okay. So I'm just going to set me onto the side. I'm going to take the accessories out of it. Okay, so this is the bathtub. It's plastic and pink, and there's a design on it. And let me just say, it was very hard to get this out. It, there were little, like, screws on the bottom, and they were connected to the box. I didn't get even the screws out all the way, because, um, I just excited and you need a screwdriver so it's very hard to get out of the box so be prepared see so yeah, it's pink and plastic they also sell them in purple i think but anyways okay so it comes with this and this <laughs> took us a while to get on but you attach it with this part and there's a part up in the corner right here that looks like that and you put it in there it does not stay on very well i'm gonna put a glue dot on it later today so it stays well but anyways, so there are little dials on it, and I'm just going to take it off so you guys can see better. Dials on it right there, and those do not... Oh, wait. Okay. So this one turns. I guess maybe they do turn. Okay, yeah, they do turn. They haven't... I guess they're just like oil or... Need grease or something, but they're just kind of stiff, but they do turn. And then it comes with one of these little, you know, like faucets or whatever. I can't remember the name now. And it goes right there. Right there. And then it also comes with this, which is one of those like bathtub mats that you put in the bathtub. You can use it as like a bathroom mat and like put it on the floor next to it or something. This comes rolled up. Oh, and there's a little heart print on it. And this comes rolled up. And it's kind of hard to get it flattened out, so I'm going to put it in like a dictionary overnight to get it to stay better. But yeah, just be prepared. It doesn't. When you first get it, it won't be perfectly flat. So. Yeah. And then it has this, which is like a little tray. And I think it's cute, but the sides here, they're twisted. I would like it better. I mean, it stays on here and stuff, but I would like it better, personally. If it actually was not twisted like that, so it could latch on. It stays in place fine and everything, but I think that would just be more, you know, efficient. Um, and then it comes with three of these and they're just like you know those little things that our generation puts with almost every one of their sets and they're like three in a row and stuff i don't really like how they're clear but they're clear i'm and i've seen other bathtub sets that are pink but they come with different colored accessories so this is just one i got and i'm pretty sure they all come with the same accessories okay so then we have these three bottles also which are like perfume bottles and then you have these three which are like little little nail polish um then it also comes with like a perfect purple like pit comb which you should not use to comb your doll's hair just so that you know and then i also comes with these which come on a little piece of tape and i just still have them on that but they're little no cucumber that's where your doll's at okay then it has also a little perfume bottle and then my favorite one of my favorite pieces the little miniature Crunchy, which yes, it does fit, fit around your doll's hand. Okay, and then it also comes with these little flip flops, and I don't, I'm not loving these. I mean, they're cute, but they're just kind of like heavy for flip flops. And um, yeah, it'd be cool if it was Velcro, but it's complete plastic. All this stuff is plastic. Although these kind of these for the little nail polish, they do kind of look like beads, but I don't. They're plastic, but, you know, they look like these. Okay, so then it also comes with this green hanger. Which is cute. And then it comes with the best thing of all, this adorable owl robe for your dolls. 
just so cute. And this part actually flips over your doll's head. So, yeah. I'm just going to use me as an example real quick. I'm not going to bother unbuttoning it. But it goes like that. So it's kind of like a little Superman. And then there's a little button down here which you unbutton and off and stuff. Take it on. And if you want to see a doll wearing this, by the way, check my Instagram. I recently uploaded a photo of it. So that's all it comes with. I believe the price is from anywhere from twenty to thirty dollars. The prices vary from Target, I guess. Like maybe I don't know. I'm not really sure. But I thought this was really cute, and it's a great additional touch to my doll's bathroom. If there's anything else you want to see, like you want to see something up close with the doll, comparing to the size, just tell me, and I will post a picture of it on my Instagram, or I might make an additional video. So yeah. Um, overall, this is, like, I'd give it three and a half, maybe, like, three and three-fourths of a star. Like, it's not quite, maybe it's, like, four, yeah, I guess I could give it just a little bit below a four. Because, like I said, this is plastic, and it's really ridiculously hard to get out of the box. It was just, like, really? Does it? Okay. And this part doesn't... I think you see right there, it does not say connected at all very well. Like I said, just put a glue dot up in there, it should be fine, but, yeah. And this hanger is kind of, like, weirdly deformed. Um, and then the flip-flops, too really heavy and kind of, like, a weird material in this. I would prefer if it was a of edge, but other than that, <laughs> other than that, um, and those, like, you know, these having the curved edges, I mean, that's really something I can look past. It's like no big deal. But it fits the doll perfectly. And it's really cute actually. Um and I'm glad I got it. It's a great addition to my doll's bathroom. It's finally done, yay. So yeah, I definitely recommend it. I really do. I mean, the owl robe is just so adorable, I can't even handle it. But yeah. So that's my review on the Our Generation doll bath tub set, pink version. Do you have a pink one? Um, yeah. <laughs> this is A.G. Chloe, signing off. Bye-bye. Uh,